Hello and welcome to all. In this video, we will learn how to rectify, how to solve the error of provision account key missing for condition type in schema. But before we start, if you are not yet subscribed to our My Support Solutions YouTube channel, then click on the subscribe button. Also, don't forget to click on the bell icon so that you will get the latest updates after every new video upload. This is totally free. Please like and share this video. Share the knowledge. Sharing is caring. Now let us start. So in this video, we will learn how to rectify this error. So right now, see, I'm trying to create a purchase order. Okay. I'm in the transaction code of uh, ME21N. And while creating purchase order, system has flashed me this kind of error. I click on this red mark again. So this is the error. Provision account key missing for condition type ZAK2 in schema AK90. This is my condition type ZAK2 which I have created and I have created my schema is AK90. So how to rectify this error that we will learn. So right now I will close, I will uh, open another session. Okay. And here put SPRO press enter click on img button then click on the materials management then click on the purchasing in purchasing we have to click on the conditions okay now in conditions define price determination process and define calculation schema so click on the execute button on define calculation schema click on execute now see this is my procedure ak90 system has flashed the error for this procedure so what we will do is we will select the line of this procedure ak90 and double click on control data so i will double click on control data now see this is my condition type ZAK2 system has given the error for this condition type ZAK2 again I will show you see I will open my previous session and of ME21N and now see this is the error for ZAK2 okay for provision account key missing for condition type ZAK2 now see In ZAK2, this is a uh, in column of accruals. Okay, see this is line of ZAK2. Now in this column of accruals, I will click on the first find button and uh, I will select freight provisions FR2. ZAK2 is a condition type for freight, and uh, in accruals column, I will select fr2 for freight provisions now i will save the record but this will not be enough to rectify this error we have to check that to fr2 whether we have assigned general ledger or not okay so right now i will save this record so yes click on the continue now we will use a transaction code OBYC. OBYC. Here I will put slash n OBYC. In OBYC, we will check uh, or assign the general ledger for FR2 posting. Okay. So slash n OBYC. Now we have to select FR2. Okay so this is fr2 freight provisions okay so i will double click on fr2 we have to select our chart of accounts our chart of accounts is ab90 so click on the continue button now see here we have to uh, we have assigned the respective general ledger account so i will click on this if you have not assigned the gl then we have to assign the respective gl over here okay right now gl is already assigned to this okay so see 86100 this is a general ledger freight provision for our company ak90 and chart of accounts 
now we'll take back but we have to we have to keep in mind that if you have not assigned the respective gl to our transaction fr2 then we have to assign the respective general ledger over here and then we have to save the record okay now again we will check in our purchase order so this is our purchase order screen i will click on the check button now system again checking for error so okay i will take a back okay and uh, again i will put me 21n press enter now again we will uh, create that uh, purchase order now see i put vendor over here give material quantity plan code okay and then we have to give our purchase organization detail in header now here i will give my purchase organization purchasing group okay now see system is again uh, now yeah there is no error now okay so we have to rectify this error okay see this is our purchase order we have rectified this error i will then save our purchase order so this is how we can solve the error of provision account key missing for condition type in our schema okay so that's all now for this video yeah i will save the record i will save the purchase order okay we click on the save button so this is a purchase order number okay so um, that's how we can solve the error we can rectify the error of provision account key missing for condition type in schema so thanks for watching this video and if you have any queries or suggestions regarding this video please feel free to comment and again don't forget to subscribe to our my support solutions youtube channel and click on the bell icon to get free and latest updates after every new video upload again thanks for watching keep in touch and bye bye